OSPAC for us represents over 350 exhibitors with uh, over 1,200 international brands coming to Australia under one roof. International brands such as KUKA bring to Australia an opportunity to work with local businesses and engage with local manufacturing. So OSPAC represents how we can make manufacturing in Australia more competitive, more productive, more efficient to compete on a global scale. Here we are in 2017 and we're talking about industrial revolutions. We're talking about Industry 4.0. Before you would go into the factory and the people and the robots and the machines are separated. Now we're designing that you walk into the factory and you're together. There's collaborative robots and there's people. The collaborative robots are enhancing the people. They're not replacing them. The collaborative robots and the people are then working with traditional robots. This is the three sectors of the robots that are working in the factories that are being developed today. What we can see is more and more the trend of B2C business models, which means companies are adapting their business models towards smarter production and logistics which brings totally different areas of automation. So this is what it's all about, about Industry 4.0, is digitalization throughout from the customer back to the raw production material. And we as KUKA have very good principles and good technologies to offer for that. To make a human collaborative robot, we must be able to limit various physical properties such as force, power, stress and energy transfer. KUKA has achieved this by integrating Safe Talk Sensor in LVR-EWA, which enables the robot to essentially feel its surroundings. LVR-EWA is programmed using Java. It's a common programming language. To program our tic-tac-toe demonstration, I could look up on Google, for example, tic-tac-toe codes that are written by many other Java programmers around the world, and simply add motions of the robot to play the game here with the visitors in Hospet. On our booth here, we're launching the KUKA KR3 Agilis. It's the smallest robot in our range. It's ideal for a lot of the consumer sector. We also have the KUKA Agilis, which is in hygienic format, also designed specifically for the consumer sector. The Agilis HM stands for Hygienic Machine. It was designed specifically for the food and consumer industries, where wash down and high levels of hygiene are, are critically important. The KR3 is the smallest robot in the KUKA family. With its three kilo payload and high speed, it's ideal for fast moving consumer goods. All of these things will come together along with Industry 4.0 and products such as KUKA Connect, which is being developed and released at the moment, where people will be able to connect all the robots and all the equipment within their factory. And it doesn't matter where you are. If you're the factory manager, you're the owner of the small business that's manufacturing consumer goods, you've got connectivity to your factory wherever you are. You don't need to look at a big report. You're customising this sort of information to what you need to run your factory efficiently. This is where we are here, and that's what we're talking about on the Cooker Booth. Orange Intelligence.